We've got all our ops done, just about. Now we're going to champ here. This is the bugaboo, my bugaboo for sure, and the bugaboo of many beginners. Because we do a 2D chamfer, so that allows us some modicum of control. However, it's so easy to get this wrong because of all these different uh, profiles, 12 chains, and then, like I say, one of these arrows in, is in the wrong spot. Like, wh what are we machining here? I don't know. What, what do you know? It looks like maybe this hole, but we want to go from the up. Uh, uh, yeah, exactly. So you just kind of got to fiddle fuck around with it. I had tried to do these profiles. Doesn't want to do it in the simultaneous. It gets all cattywampus. And it's nothing for you to destroy a, a carbide mill chamfer mill in seconds so this little tip here so what we do is we choose the chamfer width 10 thou tamp chamfer width offset that's just how deep you're gonna go so that it offsets automatically and then the chamfer clearance is how far from other uh, profiles other geometries it stays away so it only stays 10 thou it's pretty good that way but you know, if it's machine and right or left or, yeah. This one's super fucky, I'm telling you. You got to mess with it. 